Hi, my name is Caleb with MicroCenter Technical Support, and today I'm going to talk to you about user account control settings or UAC settings. If you've ever tried to install a program or run a program and a little box comes up informing you that something is trying to make changes to your computer, that's a UAC dialog box. So today we're going to change those settings and maybe make those go away or come back, whatever your situation may be. So let's go ahead and take a look at how to do that. Okay, let's go ahead and change those user account control settings. First thing we'll do is head to the start menu and from there to the control panel. Once we're in the control panel, if we're not already in category view, we can get there by selecting view by and then category. Once we've done that, we'll select user accounts and family safety. And from there, user accounts. And then user accounts, we'll click on the link that says change user account control settings. Once we've clicked that, this dialog box will open. Uh, the slider on the left, as we move that up and down, will offer descriptions on the right of each setting that we can select here. Um, the default setting that Windows will offer you will uh, basically notify you anytime a program tries to install or make changes to your system. Uh, that's recommended for newer users of Windows 7 and uh, basic users overall. The very bottom setting will disable those notifications, and this is more intended for users who frequently make changes and are very familiar with Windows 7. Uh, as you can see here, Windows 7 does not recommend that. Once we've read through and we've selected the setting that we'd like, we'll hit OK and confirm should we need to using the Yes button here. Close out the windows. And that's it. That's how you change UAC settings in Windows 7. Thanks a lot for watching, and for more information, please check out www.microcentertech.com.